What's up everybody? This next one we got forward lunges, wall sit, and supine windshield wiper. We're gonna repeat it four times. So this is a circuit of three exercises. First two, so forward lunges give you 45 seconds alternating, and then 45 seconds on the wall sit as well. And then we're gonna end with repetitions on the supine windshield wiper. So giving y'all time, or giving y'all a break for some time. That's what I meant to say. And then uh, so forward lunge is going to be lugs, uh, legs, excuse me, and then wall sit is going to be some more legs, some more hamstrings, quads. Supine is going to be a little bit rotational core. So getting a lot of lower body, but also some core in this one. So first uh, exercise, I'm going to start my timer. I step forward, drop that back knee, bam, right into a forward lunge. You can control the speed at which you go in and out of it. As long as you're getting full depth, that's really the thing that I care about. If you need to, like I said, you can step, slow it down, whatever's gonna allow you to get the best repetitions. So 45 seconds there, take about a 10 second rest, 15 second rest maximum. Then we're gonna move into wall sit. So just getting on the wall, getting to where your, uh, your quads, your femur, so above your knee, below your hip, is about parallel to the ground, and the knees are straight up perpendicular to the ground, and holding on the wall, for 45 seconds. And then the last one, leg lift. Okay, 45 seconds, or excuse me, supine windshield wiper is over. Or wall sit is over. Wow. I'm, I'm talking, man. Okay, so what I'm gonna do now is bring the, both legs up in the air, feet and knees off the ground. I'm gonna move to one side, just like my legs are windshield wipers. And then I control, stop before I hit the ground go to the other side. If you notice, I have my elbows by my side. I am not pressing into the ground, but I do have them here for stabilization, whereas if I lift it, I lose a little bit of stability. Now, my main goal here, uh, with most of our stuff in the supine or laying on their back position, we want to make sure that we don't have a lot of room between our low back and the ground. So before I even go, I like to point my belt buckle uh, forward toward my belly button or bring my belly button into the ground, whatever makes sense to you. So I'm doing that before I even go, and this really levels up the exercise a lot because now I'm not having a lot of that strain or work going my lower back. It's all going to my core, which is what we want. So on that, you're gonna get 10 each side. We have the circuit four times, y'all. Let's go.